Good morning everyone in my NAE 100 class. Hi, I'm Rachel. Um, for my multimedia project, I'm just gonna do a video talking about my life and everything that's going on, all right? So, the first question, what has gone surprisingly well by your transition this far? It's, um, so far, it's been good like I'm now doing well um before it was really hard but now that I am in a better living situation it's gotten better well my classes have gone very well I believe um I'm not like slacking off as much as I did in high school um so the transition hasn't been that hard, but it has been difficult in certain points. That's really it. What are some unexpected challenges you have experienced thus far? All right, let me get into it. So I arrived at NAU and met my roommate. We got along really well at like not really well, but like okay at first. She had like home friends and I had no friends, but like, I would hang out by myself and I'd be totally fine with that. She, cause I would, I get up really, really early. I get up at 4 a.m. every single day, just because that's how it was in high school. I got up every single day, really, really early. It's just cause like, that's me. But she like started to kind of act weird towards me after her friends came over and I said something that might have offended them in any way, even though it was just a question I asked, but I did offend them. Because I offended them, she didn't know how to approach me on the topic, so she waited over a week and a half to talk about what had happened. But as she approached me about the topic, she approached me about other things that she kind of like was upset about. So she approached me about watching her sleep and about like watching her change or whatever just because she felt that way and everything like that but it all started to go downhill after that conversation and her boyfriend came up for the weekend I didn't feel comfortable being in the room even though I said it was okay I just didn't feel comfortable at all after he got here and my roommate didn't understand that it was just a big problem, and I don't think she still quite understands why this happened. So, because of this, I started sleeping in the resource room and other places. Like, I would, like, spend, like, my entire night in the Klein Library or would hang out in the computer lab and do homework all night stuff like that so that's some unexpected challenges i didn't ever expect to be facing really serious roommate challenges because she became very passive aggressive and blamed me for the reason that i we were like not working out very well um on the other hand i moved i did end up getting out of the situation but that's for another time what have you learned about yourself? I have learned that I will go to great lengths to avoid a situation. I didn't want to talk about the topic at all. I skated around it. Like, I didn't want to talk to her at all, so I avoided her at all cost. Go home really, really late, leave really, really early. Never, ever, ever be in the room. So I've learned that about myself. I've also learned that I can be very difficult to talk to when I don't mean to be, I mean. Like she was trying to talk to me and I didn't want to talk to her. And so she made it feel like I was trying to avoid her no matter what, which maybe I was, but I was, I was, I was, I was. Um, 
but I've learned that about myself that I need to fix that I need to take the problem and face it head-on and not really um, change who I am for another person or change myself because of another person so yeah where are you now in your transition and where do you want to go from there um In my transition right now, I'm sleeping a lot more. So, like, doing, like, the sleep journal was very, very beneficial to me. Um, I did realize some things. Maybe another, like, 30 minutes of sleep every day. Or maybe another hour of sleep would be very beneficial to me and my health. Because... Maybe I'm just thinking because of my bad situation that I don't need I don't need to sleep less anymore. So that um, so that can be fixed. Um, um, something else that can be fixed is I want I want I wanted to improve my mental health because because of that it was just very difficult so learning about the, the topics in class really has helped me so I feel that if I keep working at them it will be very beneficial to me as a person and to everyone around me so yeah um let's see i don't understand sometimes transitions but the biggest transition i faced was coming to college and i conquered that because i didn't want to come to college at first i just wanted to go into the air force and do that but my parents wouldn't allow me to but now I can because I'm gonna do I'm doing Air Force ROTC, so that has helped me in my health and everything because that's kept me grounded and not feel like I need I'm like gonna go crazy or whatever. So yeah, that's it. Thanks for watching my video.